just wanted to do a mock-up of the station wagon. I was starting to draw one and you know that's just like way too much time. Sometimes mock-ups are overrated but in reality you know I want the car to sit a certain way and look good. So a mock-up you know you could play around with stuff on the computer and then it becomes time to set the frame in the car exactly where I want. I've, I've looked at it tons of different ways like it'll make that a lot easier. Funny is I couldn't find one picture of the car together that I had so I found this picture of a another 68 station wagon and then I found a picture of a Crown Vic with the exact same wheels I'm gonna use so I kinda already did this on my art program I use uh, Inkscape which is a free you know vector art program and what I did was is I was able to just outline it I outlined the drawing and, and then you I go to view clip set and it cuts it out and then I put this body over that after I resized it but so I'll just uh, go through the steps real quick I, I ended everything I did I'm gonna redo it now okay so see I cut it out then I brought in the Crown Vic turned it around and then kinda resized it and you know I was see there you can uh, mess with it so you can see where I was you know, you could do all types of crazy stuff. So this isn't going to be perfect, but you know, all the, I'm not really messing with the body panels. So all the body panels are going to go back on and I'm using this exact, these exact same wheels. You know, maybe I could scale it a little bit better so I knew exactly this was this distance. So, you know, I could come in here and, you know, it's kind of cool having the curb in the street, too, and the shadow. Uh, this honestly looks way better than I didn't think I was going to, you know, I thought I was just going to get a picture of some wheels and shove it under there. It's kind of cool to overlay it on this car and have the background with the shadow. I want the car to be functional, so I don't want it too low, uh, but I do want it to look badass. And I don't necessarily want it to be raked, but, you know, the more you lower it, the rear end, it just seems kind of, you know, saggy. I guess that'd be about even right there. You know, and so, you know, I'm, I'm probably just going for a even look, maybe a little bit higher in the rear. Because I'd rather it be a, t a touch higher than, you know, sagging in the back. And, uh, you know, I'll play with that. That's, that's of course, that's too low. I don't want the front end that low, but. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to just go out and play with this. But yeah, maybe when it comes time to actually fit it to the car, I'll have a, um, you know, a better idea of what I'm looking at and what I'm looking for. Give, give my brain uh, something to think about in the meantime. So that's the other thing that's the question too is the Crown Vic frame is just a touch longer than the body. And like I said my scaling is probably not perfect on this. Um, but originally I was thinking to set the rear wheel back a tad and center the front by looking at it it almost looks better to just center the back wheel and let the um, put the front off center that makes it I think it makes it look a little more aggressive that way so that's like with the front centered and again you know this isn't like a perfect representation and then that's like with the back centered like it looks way more natural with the front at least on this now it looks way more natural for the front to be off center than it does the back um but you know some of this uh where it mounts where i'm hitting the the roll pan and stuff or the old torque box where it meets the rocker panel right here where the frame's going. Or some of that might actually decide where I'm going to put it. 
So, uh, we'll see. Well, right now I'm really liking the making sure I don't, you know, sag too much in the back. It's liking centering the back wheel and having the front be off center because that really does look the best to me. And, you know, I keep putting it all different types of ways and it just seems like lo just low like that is the best still. Um, wonder what happened if I just move it up. Because, I mean, I want the thing to be practical. Well, see, that's, that's pretty low still, and that moved it up quite a bit. You know, even something like that's probably more realistic. Because we're lining up almost the bottom of those, let's say, we line up those that's probably where it would sit without cutting out that notch too much of it if it sat where I'm about to put it right now it's probably gonna sit like that but I do you know I do have some wiggle room on angle and forward and back and stuff but yeah I think that's gonna wrap it up for the video I just wanted to just show you guys what I was messing with all right later